Here we are today. I have a very big dream for this school, where we shall have St. Joseph Mahiga Secondary School. St. Joseph Mahiga. Education shouldn't end after the eighth grade, but how does this two-person nonprofit handle building a high school in Kenya? So welcome to Mahiga Hope High School. <laughs> We have 366 kids in the primary school up through yeah. level eight. When those kids finish right now, there's no more school for them to go to. No more school for them to go. The local leadership is in full support of what the Nobility Project is doing and their partners. Putting infrastructure in place is key because we can churn out young people who have had an opportunity to improve their lives. There'll be eight classrooms, the library, and the computer lab, and there's 40-something guys on site. I just can't get over how big the structure actually is going to be. It's one thing to see it in the drawings, but... One afternoon of rain after a short dry spell, and uh, lorries full of materials cannot get out to the site. No we're construction. No construction at all. They've been hiring a contractor and spending thousands of dollars to uh, pave this road. The parents said, we'll do it. I know I like which Mahiga means stones, and stones are obstacles in most, most of the times. This is a school which has so many obstacles, but there is hope. There's poverty here, but I see that you are very rich in courage and in strength and in spirit. We are going to do our best. We are going to do our best.